Hey, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? It is Brittany Wapoom's Revenge here, and today we're gonna be talking about basically World War II and how we have two months left before the release date, and every Call of Duty player basically hates Black Ops 3 now because they think it's boring and they just want the next COD to come out. So yeah, we're gonna jump into a team deathmatch and we're just gonna talk about this. If you think it's a great idea, go ahead and drop a like down below, maybe even subscribe. Let's get started. Alrighty, so we're gonna be playing on Nuke 10 while we talk about this interesting topic because in reality What are we gonna do in this game? We've pretty much done everything that we could possibly do You know, we have the last Grand Slam contract, which I feel like they meant Grand Slam as like, you know, their last thing to offer But that's just kind of my opinion. I could be wrong. You know, I don't follow DLC as much as other YouTubers do Oh my god, there's people there really is people. Oh my god, you just got destroyed. But everyone's so hyped up about World War II that they don't even want to play this game anymore. You know, it was boots on the ground. This is a totally different feel. I mean, duh, you're using jetpacks. That doesn't exist in this future COD. So no one wants to go back to this futuristic crap when all they want is boots on the ground. Of course, we all know Black Ops 3 is nearly two years old now. And it's just become stale. I mean, they've done a great job implementing DLC weapons, contracts, you know, of course, DLC 5. They've done a great job with that, but there's really nothing else to do. It's been two years, you know, if you're not Master Prestige, you're probably not going to be. You could use me as an example. I'm not going to be Master Prestige. I'm probably never going to go back to playing this game unless it's for zombies because Let's be honest, Zombie Chronicles is actually pretty darn cool. So in my opinion, if you're gonna be doing something in Black Ops 3, I would say just play Zombie Chronicles, or just play zombies in general. Multiplayer is kind of stale, maybe go back and do the campaign if you really want to. But yeah, try some new things, maybe become a sniper if you're not a sniper. If you are a sniper, just use a gun. Just use an actual automatic weapon. Because I just hate snipers, alright? I just do. They're so annoying and they just irritate the crap out of me. So, yeah. We all have to hold on to Black Ops 3 a little longer because we all know it was a wonderful game. We all love it. We really do like the futuristic function in here. We didn't like it in Infinite Warfare. We really didn't like it in Advanced Warfare. But Black Ops 3 did an incredible job with it. And I still enjoy playing this Call of Duty. But I'm not a person that plays Call of Duty basically religiously. I don't have time for that. So all you people that grind Call of Duty, yeah, I'm not one of those people. I used to be someone that could sit here for 6-8 hours a day and just play Call of Duty. But I've lost the interest and I've become way too busy with college and work that I can't do that. So for me, Black Ops 3 is not a stale game. So all you people freaking out because you have two months left? Just relax, you've waited for a boots on the ground for almost three years now. A brand new boots on the ground for almost three years now, okay? You can wait two more months, it's not even that hard. And I just got killed by a grenade. Well ladies and gentlemen, if you did enjoy the video, go ahead and drop a like down below and maybe even subscribe. Hopefully you guys could hold on two more months before the next Call of Duty comes out. So, hope you guys have an awesome day and I will definitely see you guys later.